Hey guys, Seven WWE Rocks here, and today I'll be talking about a big update to a huge dream match for Ring of Honor for their Supercard of Honor uh, coming up, you know, WrestleMania weekend, of course. Uh, but real quick, I just want to say this didn't even do it on purpose, guys, I swear. Wore this even though I had no idea, I totally forgot. Uh, Lucha Underground Season 1 and 2 are on Netflix now for your streaming goodness. So I know a lot of people missed out on Lucha Underground just because they didn't have the channel. Um, so that sucked, but now, season 1 and 2, they're on season 3 currently, uh, but 1 and 2 are on Netflix, so definitely you start watching, catch up, it's a great show, especially season 1, I think season 1 was, uh, perfect. Season 2 kind of went off the rails, but it's Lucha Underground, of course, gonna go off the rails, it's gonna be insane, so both are amazing seasons, nonetheless. Uh, but today's video, Ring of Honor just tweeted out like 10 minutes ago. The Young Bucks were colliding with the Hardys uh, for the tag titles, for the Ring of Honor tag titles. Originally, this is this match has had a lot of updates because of the whole TNA thing. So originally, wasn't even going to be on the show. Just going to be a dark match. And it uh, wasn't going to be for anything, even though the Young Bucks were currently the tag champions. Currently, you know, in, in that year, in that era, not now. Uh, but they were the tag champions. Then they leave TNA, of course, the Hardys. So now it was the Hardys win the Ring of Honor Tag Titles, so the match was made in a Ring of Honor Tag Team Championship match. And then the Hardys steal the Super Kick ch uh, Championships. That's not on the line. But they've made this match now a ladder match for the Ring of Honor Tag Team Championships, which I'm really happy about. That should be freaking mental. And uh, there's a little, little hinting of uh, it being a pay-per-view because someone tweeted... Uh, why isn't this a pay-per-view? I mean, this is just insanity. This is going to be insane. And Nick Jackson tweeted back, stay tuned. So, I don't know if that's just being a young buck being, you know, that, that dirt sheet, you know, hinting at things that aren't really going to happen. I don't know if he's doing that. But I could see it very well being an internet pay-per-view. I don't know about an actual uh, pay-per-view, you know. Uh, but it's a ladder match now. So that should be really, really exciting and fun to watch. I mean, the Young Bucks... The heart is, of course, we know they're the kings of the ladder matches. The Young Bucks, of course, with PWG and Ring of Honor, they aren't afraid of ladder matches as well. I mean, they, like, murdered each other and uh, Addiction and Motor City Machine Guns. So, this match, I'm really, really looking forward to. It makes me want to get the DVD if it isn't a pay-per-view. And uh, I'm, I'm really happy with this. I'm really excited. That card's freaking stacked. They're bringing in all the freaking people in for the WrestleMania weekend. They got Jushin Dunn, their Liger, uh, other, C or other New Japan people, and CMLL people. Um, we got uh, Adam Cole supposed to face Dalton Castle for the title. But I think since Christopher Daniels, of course, holds it, he's going to verse Dalton Castle for the title. And maybe Adam Cole versus Kazarian since, uh, since the whole uh, Bullet Club shenanigans and breakup and stuff. So... Ladder match, that's freaking awesome. I can't wait. Um, that's a main event, definitely. And WrestleMania weekend, that should be a lot of, lot of fun if you're in the area. So thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all the good stuff. Follow me on Twitter, at 7 WWE Rocks. Are you excited for Supercard of Honor? And uh, will you be watching some Lucha Underground on Netflix now? Let me know. Thanks so much for watching. As always, have a great day.